The weather stunning here at the Keza Sibutelo Stadium, or Butabelo to be exact. Elsewhere, the dark crowds gathering around Neturena. Lovely vegetation, agriculture at its best. The streets lined with arts and craft. Well, both teams are no need to be crafty in order to ensure that they get their mandates done and dusted. Lovely first touch from Chopani. You would have thought, you would have uh, banked your money that at least the keeper would have been uh, pushed into a save of some sort after that delicious delivery. Yusuf Bunting was normally so prolific in front of goal as an early sighter remonstrates with himself. Chopani continues the run. Touch from Bunting. Chopani keeps it in. No, he doesn't. Arguably, Chiefs is best uh, well, what move of uh, the half. Bunting finding Chopani. Look at that. How about that for a touch? Wow. Detromi with a measured pass. Detromi continues his run. Instead, it's found through. Makanya, two players converge on him. Wouldn't have counted even if he got a shot on target. Another player being flagged for offside. A, sign, a signal of intent, nonetheless, for Dikwena. He shows a coach. Diale. I think she'll be pleased with her, how her team has been defensively solid. Tibedi gives it to Kosinyi Pilengobo. What a turn. Finds Bunting. Thinks about it. Bunting has a shot. Is that a penalty? Refi says no. Platinum Star survive. The Chiefs finally quickening up the tempo and finding the gaps. Diantia, did he save? Or did he keep the ball? And he did. But his teammate or his cross was too strong. Due to the fact he was uh, perhaps overstretching slightly, and as that shot from uh, Bunting took a slight bobble, perhaps that, uh, that was uh, what helped the defender unwittingly. Didn't know too much about the ball, didn't even know where it was. You need to be versatile as a player. You, you, you give your coach more options when you can play two or three positions, and uh, this is what we see now. And uh, they can bring the like of Asanda when the Platinum Stars players are tired. Now, it's a Tiki. A Tiki. Katakon Sabeleng, an amazing run. Katakon Sabeleng bounces it in. Come hook or crook. Katakon Sabeleng said, I'll give you some of that sh sh sugar. That sugar ding ding. And Chiefs have lift off here at uh, Keza Sibocello Stadium. Their fans needed it. The club needed it. Katakon Sabeleng. Opening his account uh, in this uh, multi-choice uh, disc shield. And um, he took the responsibility, Temba. He took on the ball outside the box. This is where he carries the ball and he brings in he brings in a couple of defenders. Passes one, two, three. And the keeper to beat. And he toe pokes it underneath the keeper. And uh, even more interesting is that uh, Platinum Stars only have now one sub left on the bench after introducing one of uh, those two subs available. It's uh, Tsepo Chayine coming on for the very ineffectual Katako Molifi. Chayine's first duty or first port of call is to provide defensive assistance. Moses got it up and over, but he Paramafi drops the ball. Luckily for him, from an uh, ensuing chance. The ball was not on target. Apologizes. That's Tata on Amafi again. You mentioned it not so long ago about the lack of concentration of some of the government at uh, this or this sort of a uh, division. Clip over the ball. Lovely find. Good, decent to first touch for Khatepe. They are in our Chiefs. Can Chiefs finish it off? Yes, indeedy, they do. Space is left at the back there for... The likes of that man, Riamel Teleokota, he's threatened since coming on to replace Yusuf Panting. Chief do indeed get the second, and I think the points are going to Neturena. It's 2 0, five minutes to go. It's the composer. Composer that um, Lekota had inside the box. He took a first touch, he looked at the keeper, and he dipped it over the keeper. Look at the pass. This is what um, Kaiser Chiefs have been doing. They've been creating chances. An interesting mixed bag of results in the opening weekend of uh, the competition. Chiefs will finish it off in style with a man for performance 2-0.